Mm. I don't hear anybody say that said they are tired. Except mm. when you are welcome. You see people embracing you and they congratulate you. Yes. Yes. You say, thank you. Welcome for making it. Uh -huh. Welcome for Welcome. making it. <laughs> Welcome for making it. It's just like you are complete. That was the reason I turned around and I told the Lord. After mm. I was conducted around everywhere, and he said, you see what nothing. people are missing? And another thing oh is that, God. another thing is that in hell, every one second, people are being pushing, oh being pushed, God. and they're screaming and crying. But in heaven, in a minute, you know how many people get there? Yes. One or two. In a yeah. whole one minute. Oh my God. Before you see hell open and you see the excitement, Ooh. you see the joy. That is the different thing mm -hmm. I saw there. And I tell you, man of God, it's a mm -hmm. place that everyone should long to be. Should long, yes. You should long to be there. Sure, yeah. So glorious, so beautiful, undescribable. There is no mm -hmm. word that can describe heaven. Amen. And the Lord told me, have you seen this? I said, yes, Lord. He said, go and tell the world what you oh, have seen. Wow. He commanded me to tell the church what I see yes. and to tell the world what I see. But mm. I had a problem. I wanted to remain there. Oh. I said, no, <laughs> Lord, I want to remain here. <laughs> to go. <laughs> Before I could speak oh, again, the gate was open. I uh -huh. was thrown out. Oh my God. Then, uh, let me leave you to say something because I need to proceed to say yes. what really happened when I came back to London, oh, okay. my house. <laughs> you know, uh, heaven is not a dream anymore to you because you witness it. That's right. And how can you encourage, like, you know, someone with, who is right now, who is suffering or in sickness and whose life is coming to an end? And about the thoughts of heaven, how can you encourage them? Do you encourage them to stay where they are or what? Or how do you encourage people to, to focus or let the heaven in view while, while they are still here on earth? Praise the Lord. Um, each time I go to meet a Christian suffering, yes. my thought quickly go to Lazarus. Mm. I, 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 I always wish within me, I, say, I wish this lady can know yes. where she's going uh -huh. or this man can Amen. know where he's going. Amen. That he will rather tell the Lord, yes. don't keep me he here much longer to suffer. Mm -hmm. Take me home. I see. Take me home. Because it is good that we need people in the flesh. It is good that we have brothers and sisters around us. Mm -hmm. But if you happen to get to see what I saw, then you don't have. I mean, you don't have <laughs> anything to lose. You have nothing to worry. You know that I'm going to rest. Come, I see people <laughs> suffering. Yes, I believe that. I see, I go to Love. hospital to pray for people. Mm -hmm. I see people suffering. I see people passing through. Mm. Tribulation, shame, and mockery, and disgrace, sickness is plaguing them no. down with yeah. all form of infirmities. Mm. And I look, I say, Lord, can, it would be very tough for me to get to very this tough. person and say, why yeah. don't you tell the Lord to take you home? Yeah, it's I say, Lord, let me go hard. and pray for the person because they will not, they will they think remember, I am crazy. Yes. They will say, hey, this man is, there is something wrong with him. Instead, I say, I say, Lord. Since they need this present life and we need them, Lord, save them, heal them, Amen. and let them live. Amen. But while living longer, don't let them make mistakes. Yes. Because while we are sick, we make a lot of mistakes. Yes, while we, in the way of seeking help, seeking healing, and so on, we can be taken to places we never wish to go in Amen. our lives. That's why I've always prayed a prayer. Lord, when you know that I've finished my ministry, Take me home. Don't let Amen. one minute be added. Amen. <laughs> you never know. You never know. You know, people who don't know God and his heavenly kingdom right now, even, you know, regular people, makes false assumptions about God. You know, sometimes they would think, you know, suppose they suppose that God loves them so much because of their good works. Some people would would have based their going to heaven because they're doing good works. Does it imply that if you just do good works, you're going to heaven? <laughs> <laughs> uh, man of God, <laughs> the, 
eh, de, de un